My nose has definitely improved. I'm so glad that I did my surgeries on my nose. The original nose that I was born with, which I had surgery on back in 2013 or 2014 or something like that, uh, made me really, really, really unhappy. And I'm really, really glad that I had the surgery to get it changed and improved my life so, so, so much. The most recent revision that I got in Korea just really helped to take care of those small details that were annoying me. So if you guys don't already know this, after my first nose job, it was great. But then over time, um, a lot of scar tissue formed and I ended up kind of ruining it. So that's why I went to Korea and got it changed. Basically, I got all, all the scar tissue that was causing the weird shape um, removed. So this part of my nose, this little middle part was hanging low and it was hanging low because so much scar tissue had formed in there. And also I had a bump on my nose, which was again, from scar tissue that had formed. So I went to Korea and I got the scar tissue here removed and I got the scar tissue on my bridge removed. And now it's like a smooth slope. So overall, I'm really, really happy with the results and I'm definitely more happy than I was before I got my nose done again. So that's what's important. So as far as my nose goes, the scars are there. Um, you guys can't really see them. There's two here on the sides of my nostrils and one under here. They're barely noticeable, they're barely even scars, um, they don't really bother me, I don't even think about them. The only time I kind of notice them is maybe when I'm like putting makeup on. So I don't really notice them, they're not really an issue. As far as the breast augmentation goes, my scars are really really clean, which is something I'm really thankful for. They are a little bit dark, but I know as time goes on they will just become pink over time. I feel like a lot of people are curious about being under local anesthetic, a lot of people think it's really really scary. I've been under local anesthetic before in the past whenever I had teeth pulled out. I actually had to get like four teeth pulled out when I was a kid so they put me out for that. They knocked me out. So whenever I was going for the surgery it didn't really worry me too much but I didn't experience any dreaming and whenever I was out uh, basically I just woke up and it was over. You know it felt like no time at all. It felt like they sent me to sleep and then I woke up again five minutes later, which of course it wasn't five minutes, but it really did feel like only five minutes had passed. So you just kind of fall into really, really deep sleep, but I don't really have any memories or any dreams.